I'm going to be the premier of all Quebecers. They're saying we're here for all Quebecers, but what they've done, and I'm fearful of going forward, um, it's, it's very troubling. Quebec Premier Francois Legault re-elected Monday with a resounding majority elected and leading in 90 of the province's 125 ridings. After a campaign that included divisive comments, Legault looked to unite in his victory speech. When I say that Quebecers form a great nation, I mean all Quebecers from all regions, of all ages, of all origins. Right up to the election, what he was saying and his ministers were saying was something completely different. So we have to go with the facts on, on the ground where we are being told we, we, do, not, we do not count. He is uh, coming out with a more um, inclusive message right now, um, whereas during the campaign, um, he was at least tacitly or maybe looked the other way um, in terms of uh, some very exclusionary messages that his party was signaling. Legault and his CAQ came under fire several times for comments made around immigration. Recently, Legault saying more non-French speaking immigrants would be suicidal for Quebec. Even in Quebec, we need immigrants, we need workers, but to win votes, you're pandering to uh, uh, a sort of unfounded fear of the other. Legault on Tuesday in the Ile d'Orléans, holding his first press conference of his second mandate, saying he knows it's delicate speaking of immigration. I really want to concentrate on, on protecting French. And I know many Anglophones in Montreal who agree with that, that uh, we have to do something to stop the decline of French. Though the CAQ took home the most votes for a single party, the total votes for all opposition parties stacked up to around 57 percent. I think that tells us something. So yes, they got the seats, but in terms of the number of votes, uh, less than 50 percent. It's a win, but there's a lot of... Uh a lot going on under the surface. There's a lot of opposition. There's a lot of dissatisfaction with the policies of the Coalition Avenir Quebec. Quebec really has to look at um, how to resolve some of these divisions um, because it, it seems like they're still there. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.